reasons. Kylie Watts is joining us with an item that I don't have, uh, but I'm getting it today. <laughs> she convinced me. I, I tried it. I used it. I said, wait a minute. This is a great idea and a better price because in the past, am I not mistaken here, Kylie? We had one of these for like $30. We now have two of them from Bell & Howell. These are automatic soap dispensers. So one could be for hand soap, one could be for dish soap, uh, one could be for one room, one in the next room, you get the idea. But what are you seeing here? Well, better idea when you need that soap and you just want an easier way to have access to it. Great to have you back. Great to be here. Thanks Brand so new. much. One color, one clean color, mm -hmm. white. The color that you're seeing here is not the color of the, of the unit, but the color of the soap, like the dish soap. That's right. So what's the magic? What's the magic? So the magic is, we all know, Rick, there's a lot of things that we don't want to touch, right? These days, we got to be careful with what we're paying attention to. And this is something that's an everyday high-touch area in your home. So right. that means hand sanitizers, your hand soaps, your face washes, anything that you can pour into this, you can use. And what's cool about it, it's battery operated. You're going to put four AAA batteries in the bottom, turn it into on position. They last forever. And when you do. Because they only use up power when it's activated. You can see right here. Now this one's empty. I'm just showing you how it works. When you get in front of it, that light illuminates. It's going to run for three seconds, automatically turn itself off. You can put up 10 ounces of your fluid inside of this, so your soaps and everything. It's like we have it in our bathrooms here, at our restrooms here at QVC. Totally. In yeah. all the high-end hotels, spas, you go in the grocery store, everything is automatic. I, I want it. Hey, uh, all for three easy payments of $9.98. Didn't bring a lot of these in today. Brand new at this price, an expiring price that goes up at the end of the day. So let's do now. Here's the big. Now you show the tutorial. Yeah. Here it is in action. Here's how difficult it is to use. It's Watch so this. difficult. You literally so difficult. I'm putting hold this it sponge underneath in there. front of it. You see it's going to run for three seconds, give you that perfect amount of soap, and then automatically Don't turn like itself it. off. Love it. One, That's hand two, sanitizer right there three. for you. Hand sanitizer. I love that. Mm -hmm. So now you have that perfect amount. And, and here's how it works right here. So there's actually a little sensor at the bottom right here. Okay. Right here. It's a little harder to see on the white. And then underneath, too, there's another one right here. So as long as you get in between that beam. Between, gonna, the, between the beam. Yeah. And what's cool, so you'll notice, too. So if we put our hand here and we were like, oh, we got enough. As soon as we move our hand away from it, it automatically turns itself off, too. But if you hold it there, three seconds is that perfect amount. Quick, simple, easy. You don't have to touch anything. Don't have really to touch nice. anything. No touching. Which mm -hmm. is Great if you are, for example, I got, I got an, uh, uh, one thought immediately. I cut open the Rostelli steak. Okay. I put it right, I've, I've, I, I have my, my hands in the raw meat. Of course. Right, I'm drying it off. And now do I want to touch the soap dispenser right. with the raw meat or the chicken, right? So you don't, boom, all it is. Well, now I don't need to touch it, and now I can clean. So I'm thinking not only myself, I'm thinking about people in the family. That's right? right, that's right. And you're seeing we've got the soap and we've got the hand sanitizer. But think about all the things you could use this for. This is your face wash. Of course, you're not going to put like your whipped Josie in here. We don't want it to be too thick that's going in. But so, pretty what, much. Wait a minute. What, what did you say besides the soap and besides the hand sanitizer? So, face wash. Face wash. I put my Josie milk in this as okay. well, which is awesome. The only caveat that we ask you is please don't put anything in with little scrubby beads because that could clog up the internals of it. So, no exfoliating beads. But other than that, if you can pour it in, and the trick is when you get this home, put the batteries in and fill it up you've got to prime yeah. it so you're gonna have to put your hand underneath it a couple times to actually get it to push through because you're pushing that liquid all the way through and pumping it to the you bar. know the thing is too it looks really nice it looks snazzy looks great so if this is in a powder room right if this is in a guest room and you got friends coming over for the summertime how great is that put one in there and then the soap is there automatically dispenses there's the hand soap or if you're using it in the kitchen one for hand soap one for dish soap you are getting two of these two. from bell and howell so normally it's one for 29.95 you're getting two Lucid hearing aids coming up, the free sleeve coming up, a great, great um, opportunity for you to pick this up. And now it's called Accessible Living. Why is it in this show? What do you think? Well, because it makes it easier, right? Maybe you have dexterity issues. Maybe it's harder for you to pump things. Maybe you don't want to unscrew caps off. Whatever it is, you don't want to pop the top. This is something that as soon as you get in front of it and you put your hand there, it will automatically turn itself on, run for three and a half seconds, and then turn itself off. So it just makes life a lot easier. 300 people shopping. Easy for kids as well, too. And to your point, it looks looks really nice. It looks sleek. It's high end. It's modern. You've got that beautiful kind of silhouette of yeah. it. Plus, you've got that 10 ounce reservoir. So you have the max fill line. You see where to fill it up. It's going to last a long time. You can see I put about half a bottle of soap inside. Snazzy. That's, yeah. No drippage, by the way. No drippage from this thing, right? Mm -hmm. So better, better idea. Easy use to use. Here's how it works. <laughs> I mean, we need the animation. 
Why, why can't I just be the animation? I'll just show. That's it. Is. And there yeah. it is in action. Well, and, and there you go. So we all know that there's a lot of high touch areas in our home, this being one of them. This is a great way for you to automatically dispense any kind of liquid that you have inside of your home. Again, don't put anything too thick or scrubby beads inside of this, but your soap, your hand sanitizer, um, your face wash, and of course you're getting two. So what we did over on the sink over there was I just put them side by side and think about this in your own home. Maybe it's on your, your sink where you've got the hand soap, you've got the hand sanitizer. Love the look, by the way. It looks stainless with white. Doesn't it look nice? Cute. And maybe it's right by the door. Maybe you have that hand sanitizer right by the door. You've got kids. You can, you know, tell them when you get inside, put that on your hands. Mm -hmm. Yep. See, when you put right in front of it, automatically turns itself on, turns itself off. Got it. Automatic on, automatic off. No touch whatsoever. Easy to fill. Easy to clean it up if I wanted to change the soap or change the, the kind of soap that I'm using, right? Absolutely. And I could show you where you fill it too, Rick, because it is super easy. You've got that 10 ounce reservoir and that's why we give you that clear yeah. side so you can see how much you have left in it. 500 people shopping. Top Free things. sleeve coming up in a minute, by the way. Lucid hearing aids. Great hour. Join us. So the top just pops off right here. You want to make sure you have a nice point of contact right there. Your right. batteries are going to go on the bottom right there. It's four AAA batteries. Your on-off switch is there as well. And then it lights up when you, um, you'll hear it. It'll light up. If you see it start blinking, it's time to replace those batteries, but they last a nice long time. And it just solves a problem we all have. One minute. So uh, you, you kind of spark some imagination there, because I'm Talk thinking hand sanitizer, hand soap, dish mm -hmm. soap, but like a face soap. Things oh, yeah. like that. That's oh, yeah. okay, huh? Yeah, yeah. As long as there's no beads in it. No beads, no exfoliating beads. And of course, if it's something that's super thick, like a really thick whip body butter, that's not no going to bleed through. Right. Some lotions have a thinner viscosity. If it's like your um, hand sanitizer or your soap kind of texture, you'll be fine with it in there. Ah, 600 people are shopping. First item up in a big show. Accessible Living is back. The 56414. Kylie, great to have you here. Good to be here. Okay. Thanks, Rick. More to come. Next item up. Love it. So, lucid. Coming up in a little bit. Before we get to that, this is